Hey, Eberhard crew. This is Brianna from Chipmunk SEO. I had reached out to Kayla today and she had told me I could go ahead and send you guys this video. I was just making this quick video to show you how to improve your website so that you can bring in some more customers for free. And I know you're probably wondering why I'm doing this for you guys. Um, after owning my own roofing company, I do know that business owners reach a point where they're too busy running the business to learn how to make the internet work for them and bring them more customers. And the only thing that's usually holding them back from hiring a marketing agency is they don't know who is an expert and who's frankly full of crap. So I found that by making these free attack plans and giving them away for free, there's still a lot of business owners who end up calling me back and asking me to do this stuff for them. So if after all of this you see I've got some tricks up my sleeve and I could do some real good work for you, then you can always give me a call back and we could chat. And if you want to take this information and just fix your website yourself, please do. This is just a free educational video for you. I'm going to be talking about three things today. Um, first one is going to be content, then backlinks and citations. So um, you guys have a nice simple website here and I know you service multiple locations like you, it says down here, Los Angeles, San Diego, and Las Vegas. So I'm only going to be giving an example for just one of your service areas to show you the potential of getting your website optimized correctly. Um, so Google isn't looking at the appearance of your website they're actually using bots called crawlers that are scanning your website for the content. Content is the photos, videos, and the actual text on your page. Um, the rule of thumb is you need a minimum of 1,500 words on the homepage. With you guys being in multiple service areas, I recommend at least 2,000 words so that you can be sure to beat the competition in all three areas. Um, and then on your back service pages, you want at least probably a 750 to 1,000 words so that you can outrank your competitors. Um, having all this content is important for two reasons. Google needs to be able to give you authority by scanning the information and validating you as a real business. And two, the more content you have, the more keywords you can have. You're only supposed to have 100 words of content for every key one keyword to prevent keyword stuffing so that Google doesn't think that you're some type of spam site. Um, now I've pulled up an example here of just one service location for one, uh, one of the services you provide. I know that it's pretty dynamic, so you guys can imagine the potential if you're getting all of the keywords for each of your services in your different service areas ranking and how much uh, customers are going to be flooding in from finding you on Google and trying to get you to provide service. So I'm using Roofing Contractor Las Vegas. Um, as we can see here, there's this Google My Business that pops up. You guys want to make sure you have this set up for at least one location. Um, this is important because this has all your contact company information and you're going to be wanting to have your company information sent out to citations. Citations are just online directories like Angie's List, Yellow Pages, Yelp, um, White Pages, you know, any of those online directories, you're going to want to put your con uh, company contact information out to those. And the rule of thumb is you want at least 100 more than your competitors. You're also welcome to use the same that your competitors are using. If I continue to scroll down here, I'm going to see the organic search results for this one keyword. And the top ranking company is Ariat Roofing. So we know that Ariat Roofing is one of your leading competitors in specifically Las Vegas for just the roofing industry. Um, you guys still have your solar industry and your general construction, your sheet metal. So there's a lot of different competitors that you can chase after and outrake against pretty easily. Um, I'm gonna use them as the competitor example for the remainder of the video though. So we can see here they don't have much content, which means if you guys surpass them with that 2000 plus recommendation on the homepage and the 750 to 1000 plus on the service pages, you're gonna be blowing them out the water. Um, there is still probably going to be a reason that they're ranking though first with this minimal content. So I'm going to go into a tool that I use here. This is called AREFs and I can actually see how your website's ranking. Um, and here's your website pulled up. We see that you have a low domain rating um, and that's probably coming from the websites that are linking to your site. 
So you guys have these backlinks of 699. Backlinks is when another website links to your site and drives traffic to you. And Google likes this because it's like a popularity contest and will give more power. Um, Google will give you more power and authority if you're linking with websites that are related to your industry. Okay, so you do have some options, um, but you're looking for just the construction industry right now. Um, solar, roofing, sheet metal, you can link with those, but a lot of your backlinks are causing you to drop in your ranking for Google because they're spam. And that's something that you're going to want to remove. Um, you're ranking for 70 organic keywords at the moment. So your traffic is only at a 95. And this is across uh, all your service locations. This is the pretty much the total value going on. So if we go over to just one competitor, that Ariat Roofing that I showed you, we can see here they have some backlinks coming, uh, 944 backlinks coming from 79 domains. They have a low domain rating as well, though. But they are making some improvements on their ranking for keywords and their traffic. This was my big focus here. So because we know they're high ranking on certain keywords, they're getting a lot of organic traffic for it. And we know that they're ranking first in a few things. And we can go look at what you're ranking on as well. Um, you want to be sure you're in the first position for as much as you can. So... Let's actually go ahead and go down here and look for an actual one. So Roofing Las Vegas has a 90 searches happening in just that city. And they're in the first position. So they're getting about 30 traffic from that each month. Already they're kind of getting close. You know, they're getting pretty close to what you guys are getting at. So I'm going to show you what your keywords look like. I'm trying to be sensitive of your time here. So a lot of the keywords that you guys are ranking on is your company name, which is really great. That's still something you want to rank for. But you're also trying to target customers that are looking for your services and don't know who you are yet, right? That's how we grow and expand. Um, so you're going to be needing to get more content, higher quality backlinks, um, and then the citations set up for Google My Business so that you guys can start ranking on a lot more keywords for the different services that you offer in all the areas that you service. So that's about it for this video. Um, if you guys implement those steps, I promise you're going to be ranking number one on Google. Uh, and I know you're probably wondering, what do you do now? You can either take the information I gave you and apply it yourself. That's totally okay. Like I said, this is just a free educational video for you. I just ask that you give me some feedback and let me know what you thought about the video. If you do want any help getting this stuff done or you just don't want to have to worry about it and want to focus on your business and let someone else handle this for you, go ahead and give me a call and we can definitely chat. Um, thank you so much. And I'm definitely looking forward to getting your feedback. Have a great day.